into another week. Oh, Christmas is approaching fast. And I still can't get in the mood for it. But there you go. Right, bit of bit of a dilemma. I'm on the coffee. The Ross Bucket Clone. It's been dry hopped. Citra and Amarillo. Uh, for a little, since Monday. It's now really Sunday. Ready to be kegged, bottled. No empty kegs. Ah. So, tried making a dent in the keg that's nearly finished. Didn't make a big enough dent in it. Sore head still. And it's now half three. So, uh, point or two tonight, hopefully that'll kick it for tomorrow evening when it needs to be okay. If not, it'll have to be Tuesday. Monday would be the two weeks. So, we're not, even if it goes to Tuesday, I've often left it a week and an extra day or two. It won't make any difference. So, what am I at today? Uh, this. This is my 32 amp socket, blue for single phase, 230 volt. Um, slightly better construction than the cheap old nasty one that I have on the wall. Plus it sits that way as you look at it, so you can pull the plug out that way, which is not very easy, because it's a very tight fit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mount it that way, so it's facing me, so I can just the plug straight towards me. Plus, it looks like it's got a better grip on the socket because it's in behind this plastic. You see that? It's in behind here. Whereas the other one is just screwed to the front and I just since found out if you push it in and twist it, it, it goes back into place but it doesn't lock. So it could be repaired but I've never liked the way it plugs in and out. Right, if I haven't checked this one. So, yeah, this one's just as tight, but I'll be able to pull it that way straight out instead of trying to do it that way along the wall. I'll be able to pull it this way. So, that is the plan of action. As you can see, oh, here, I don't know if you can see, as you can see there, picking down, uh, you can just about see it. You twist it a little bit, it comes off. Not ideal when you're trying to pull the plug out that way, as you can see them. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take this off. A block of timber. I'm going to mount the timber there. Once it's screwed down, I'm screwed about the way I'm making the socket that way, so I can take it in and out easy enough. So we'll get this off the wall. Power's been switched off to the panel and at the RCBO. So the power is off to live and neutral so it shouldn't i shouldn't get lit up like a christmas tree so what i want to do is slacken off that out there because i'll be reusing that the cable runs this way and up So we'll just now pull the trunk and cover off. Ooh, 
Okay. It's been interesting. I'm just remembering how it runs along the bottom one, as you can see. Probably should have re-routed this. So that gives me a good bit of slack. So I'll come up through here. That'll give me the extra slack, so I may have to cut the cable as well. Or do I really want to? Probably should. No. I'll go that way. Gives me a little bit of slack. Right. Let me uh, get this sorted a wee bit and I'll get back to you at the next stage. So that's it now fitted. So we're going to tidy it up today. So I can now plug in and unplug much easier now. Nice wee simple fix. So that was a nice easy fix. Much better for me to use now, especially unplugging and plugging in the boil pot never really thought I think through putting it in the first time I thought oh, up on the wall out of the way really I wanted one that was like that but it'd be wall mounted I think you can get them from Jeeves or Gavis so got that from work cost me about six seven euros wasn't too bad hmm that coffee's getting cold so that's it for this week uh, don't think I'm brewing next Sunday because I'm working on the Saturday and she'll probably want to do some kind of shopping seeing it's only about 10 days before Christmas next week Shit. so I'll see you next week have a good one. bye